Hello, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Back Here on YouTube. Doing another Iowa football prediction video back here again today on this Friday for tomorrow's game against Ohio State at 11 a.m. East Central Time here in the Midwest in Illinois, in the Chicago area. Beautiful day outside, 75 degrees at this time. Time of the recording here this Friday. Back at it for tomorrow's game. Ohio State and Iowa tomorrow on Fox at noon Eastern Time, 11 Central. So that's pretty much what we're here for. And guess who's back to make a prediction? Mr. Rory Jr., RJ, back at it. He's back, yes. He took a bye week last week. One thing he told me last week, and be, even though he didn't make a video or didn't do any prediction, he did a, he gave me a little preview last week before Alabama played Tennessee, and he said Tennessee was going to win. So he was right about that. But I told him he needs to know this. He needs to know this. That doesn't count for his predictions on YouTube because he doesn't go on YouTube. Didn't go on YouTube last week. He's back here. This week he only has one game. So I already gave, gave him. The, I already read him the right act and told him that if you're picking one game this week, next week you need to pick two games. So he only wants to do one game this week because he says he has a lot to break down with this matchup between Iowa and Ohio State. Ohio State has a top ten scoring offense in the country. Iowa has a top ten scoring has a top 10 defense in the country, so he told me that he likes, he told me he's very excited to see this matchup play out. And he does like Ohio State's receivers, Marvin Harrison Jr. for one, and he also likes the quarterback, C.J. Stroud for Ohio State. He likes those two players in particular. He told me, he says they're going to connect for two touchdowns, he thinks, or maybe three or more. But he says there's a few Ohio State players he likes to see Let's see how good this, he wants to see how good this matchup is going to be. He likes this matchup a lot, I believe, from what he told me. Even though Ohio State's favored to win, even though Ohio State's favored by 29 points, he did say he likes the way Iowa's defense comes into this matchup looking to win. And Roy Jr. also told me this. What were you telling me earlier? Yeah? Okay, he, he was telling me he knows Iowa's going to lose in the next six games that Iowa has. He says Iowa's going to lose at least two of their next six, and he thinks they're going to win four. He thinks they're going to win four out of six the last six games and make a bowl game, which I which I find surprising from his from what his mind is thinking. I don't know what he's thinking inside his little head of his with this game, but he says Iowa's defense and Ohio State's offense, two top ten defenses and offense, top ten offense, top ten defense. He thinks Iowa's defense is going to force some big plays backward results for Ohio State's offense, but I disagree with him that what there, but I might agree with him if he's right on that. It's going to be an interesting game to watch. I'm probably not going to watch it because I feel like I, I feel like I was going to get blown out, but I think, I think Rory Jr. has a little prediction, and here's what he wants to say. You want to say this? Yeah, you want to tell me? I'll tell him. Okay. He says he thinks I was going to score at least a touchdown this week. He was last two weeks ago. He was right about the field goal kicking between Iowa and Illinois, but he's wrong that it was going to be nine six. He said each team was going to score a touchdown, and he said Iowa was going to win. I'm sorry if he was wrong, but he was right on the field goals, hundred percent accurate with all the field goals. He was wrong, he was wrong on the touchdown part, portion where each team is going to get a touchdown. But this week he says I was going to get at least ten points. And you think the final score is going to be what? Really? You think Ohio State's going to win 28 to 10, really? So you're taking the Buckeyes this week? Yeah, you're going with the Buckeyes of Ohio State? You're not going with the Hawkeyes this week, Roy Jr.? No? You like the Buckeyes this week, really? Well, i got to give it to you. I do agree with you. So, with that being said, we both like Ohio State to win this matchup tomorrow afternoon. At least he does. I do, too. You think the final score is going to be 28 to to 10. So you don't think I was going to get blown out by 29? 28 to 10 is what you're living? 28 to 10 or 38 to 10? You say 28 to 10 or 38 to 10 are your two numbers. Wow. So he's going with Iowa. He says I was going to get a touchdown this week. Defense or offense? Offense. Okay, good. I, I, I'll believe you when, I'll believe you when, if it happens. So there you have it. We both like Ohio State to win. He wants Ohio State either to win he thinks Ohio State's going to win 28 to 10 or 38 to 10. One of those two, he thinks, is what's going to happen. He doesn't think I was going to get blown out by 29 points, like it's saying. But 
That being said, we both like Ohio State in this matchup tomorrow. Next week, he'll be back here, and I promise he'll have two games to predict. He already knows he has to do two games next week, which I think he's upset about that right now. So I'm just going to calm him down a bit after he's done here, because he's not going to want to do two games next week. He wants to do, I told him he has to do two games the next week if he does one game this week. That was a little deal. But with that being said, I hope everyone enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to watch, like, subscribe. Don't forget to tell your friends to do the same if they've not done so yet already. And please also hit that notification button below so you know when I upload a new video. With that being said, have a nice day. Stay safe and peace out. And bye for now, everyone. Bye.